Wow. When we got started on this project, I had no idea where it was going to take us. And I have to say, I have been absolutely blown away by the content, the advice and guidance that all of our experts have shared. So really sincere thanks from me to them for giving up their time and really stepping in, stepping up to support this project. I really appreciate it. So I didn't just want to leave it there with a big discussion about what the problems are. We want to be really forward thinking and uh, give you some ideas about how you can get started. So one of the things that we think is key is to find out what your members think and how they feel. And the way to do that is a survey. So we have worked with our experts to come up with a list of survey questions. Um, they've changed how we position those questions to make sure we're asking the right questions in the right way and those questions are available in our template um, guide which is part of the pdf that accompanies this video the other thing that we want to do is to really encourage people to skill up you don't know what you don't know right so we have partnered with a terrific organization called freecoursesinengland.co.uk and working with them we've come up with this list of courses that we think would be terrific now, listen, all of these are completely free. They're available online. You get a level two qualification with them, which is the equivalent of a GCSE, grade A star to C. And you can take it with you anywhere you go. It's not just for clubs, parents, teachers, anybody interested in just increasing their knowledge can take it. So here are the courses that we're recommending. Mental health first aid, children and young people's mental health, men's mental health, counseling skills, self-harm and suicide prevention, awareness of mental health problems, distressed behavior and challenges in children and understanding autism. So we hope that you all look into those courses and think they're a good idea too. We have some more resources in the guide, some cool stuff like a template letter that clubs can use and send to schools or send to a swimmer that gives to a school that really encourages the school to collaborate with us and gives the schools some ideas of things that they can do to support swimmers as well. So I haven't got time to go through everything that's in the guide. Guide, but please do check out the PDF guide. We've made all of this content completely free. So if you have found it valuable, please like it and share it and pass it on to other clubs. Let's not keep any of this a secret. And we can't wait to start hearing about the positive things that you're doing and to share those best practices so we can all work together to help improve the lives of our young athletes. Thank you so much.